Hi, I'm Tiffany with Mom Can Try. And I'm David with Frugal Marathoner. And we're here today with our son, our cross country runner and iron baby. And we're just getting ready to go out for a track workout at our local track. And right after that, I'm going to wrap it up with a 90 day review of the Baby Trend Expedition Jogging Stroller. Let you know what I think about it. Yep. All right. Let's head on out to the track. All right. Got our run in, right? Got our run in, even right. in the rain. Even in the rain. So we'll pick up this review probably after we clean up. Over here at another park, we're going to talk about our review on the Baby Trend Expedition Jogging Stroller. So we've been using this now for about three solid months of training and running and um, given that, our experience and the time spent with it, um, the baby's experience with it, um, I would wholeheartedly recommend this jogging stroller. Um, the biggest pro for this is the fact that it is so affordable. I didn't want to spend more than $100 on a new jogging stroller. I especially didn't want to spend more than $100 on a used jogging stroller. So the fact that I got a new quality jogging stroller for under $100 is great. Um, the other thing that we really like about this jogging stroller is the fact that it has the adjustable sunshade like this. So on days like today where the sun is going to be in different spots, we can actually move it to the front just like this so that we can block the sun out in baby's face if it's going towards him. The other thing, we like the multiple cup holders. So he's got a couple cup holders down here, and then we've got a couple up here. So that just makes it really nice for, especially when he's gonna be transitioning to a sippy cup, and he can have that when we're on a run. The other thing that I like is we have some storage compartments up here. So we've got the cup holders along with the storage compartment that's big enough to hold cell phones, keys, um, snacks for the baby, so anything else like that, it's just super convenient. The other thing, we have a storage compartment on the bottom of the stroller, which um, has been big enough when we've been using it, not only for jogs and walks, but to trips to amusement parks and races and all kinds of stuff. So it's just been really nice. The other thing is that it's lightweight and it's easy to maneuver. So of course I don't have any um, experience with other jogging strollers to know that anything would be heavier but it just doesn't seem like it's super bulky or cumbersome when we're running so that's just been a, a really positive experience for us. Um, the other thing that I like about it is it does have a five-point harness for the baby so it keeps him nice and secure and safe. I do have to point out that I don't think that I would use this um, with a young baby without having them in the attachable car seat until they're about six months or older um, and they have that head control. Um, just, he was about six months old when we started using this and I think that was about the perfect perfect size and perfect age for him. There's really only a couple cons that I have for this and David will agree with me on this one but um, it's super bulky. So when you're traveling and you wanna fit this in a car with four kids and two adults and suitcases and all the other fun stuff, um, it's not very compact. And so we have actually found a way around that um, where we actually take the, the tray off. The other con to this is probably gonna be with any jogging stroller is the fact that my form is really compromised and I don't know about you but it just seems like I'm running at a different form and I'm using different muscles 
um, when I'm pushing the jogging stroller than when I'm just running without it. Um, and that took some getting used to. Um, I actually took this on my first jog ever, um, about five days before my first half marathon of the year, and that was a mistake. But otherwise, I have to say, aside from the cons, the pros certainly outweigh it. I have been so happy with this jogging stroller. It's given us um, a lot of extra training time this summer that I don't think that we would have had if we didn't have this. Um, previously, we would switch um, runs off and on, um, solo runs. So he would run, come back home, and then I would run. And so um, this way we're able to run together and um, just makes our training time a little bit more efficiently. I always swore that I would never get one of these um, because I decided that running was my me time, but um, I would rather have my run than no run at all. All right, scene change and needed a break for a baby. So one of the other pros that we really like is the ability to either allow the wheel to be free running so that turns are easier or you can lock it straight so that if you're in a straight line, you can go with it straight. We prefer just allow the wheel to free run. Um, it seems to have no problems with high speed pace. I run at about um, seven minute pace, just under a seven minute pace with the stroller and had no problems with the wheel, never had any wobble issues or anything with the wheel. The other thing that we love about it is the ability to lay him down. So if he's getting sleepy and he's ready for a nap, the uh, unit actually lays back down or you can tilt it up so that he can see. So having adjustment for that is great to be able to get him in a good angle for whatever he needs if he's ready for a nap. I do like the fact that it has a safety strap that attaches to your wrist. Um, that way if you happen to trip, hasn't happened yet, but I'm a klutz and anything can happen, but um, it does attach to your wrist. So as I was saying earlier, the, the biggest pro for this stroller was the fact that um, the cost was just right on point for what we wanted to spend. It retails anywhere from about $110 to $120 before discounts or sales. With this particular model, I actually got it on sale. It was on sale for $90. And then Target had their car seat trade-in event, which they have twice a year. And the second one for this year is actually coming up. And so if this is something that interests you, I would highly, highly recommend that you trade in a car seat. You get a 20% off coupon to use towards another stroller or car seat. And that's why I was able to get this particular stroller for $72. I couldn't even, I could barely even touch a used stroller for that price. Definitely keep an eye out for that. Hopefully you can find a good deal on it just like I did. Um, just click on the links down below. We've got uh, affiliate links for uh, both Amazon and for Target that you can get these. Thank you for watching our review today. I hope that uh, this helps you make a decision on um, the type of stroller that you want to have for your babe. Um, click subscribe and like down below. Just make sure that you don't miss any of our future reviews. And uh, we'll see you next time.